Greetings and citations, viewers. I'm Star Princess HLC, back with some more Silent Hill 2 alongside Yorkshire Raven. Insert spooky Silent Hill quotes here. <laughs> okay, I went out of anyone's appeal to me. Hello, yes, I am back. Yes. I am holding the walkthrough for yep. as much or little as we use it. Yes. I did a little bit off screen. I went in here and I got the key for uh, James and Mary's hotel room and I looked up a few rooms that are currently locked. And I think I know where we need to go at least for the next cutscene, so. Let me just make sure I'm going the right direction. Oh, so noted. Lantern may or may not be still locked in my basement. Well, he'll be plenty entertained by the potatoes. Yes, he's got plenty of potatoes. Alrighty, so... Am I going the right direction or not? I don't think I am. No, I'm not. Okay. So, let me see. Upstairs, I believe I have to go. No, not the stairs. Well, they're always up to something. Up oh, and yeah. then, as, as you can see, this is where the third floor is. It's currently locked, so. <laughs> Boo. Figures. The run room place we have to go. Typical. Such typical behavior, yes. So, back out I go. Let me see here. This was... Nope, okay. And then we saw in the cloakroom there was a box or a briefcase that we need to find the code for. We still gotta figure out the stuff for the music box. Okay, the lock B case. I can see the B case is locked. You need to enter a combination of four letters, which make up an ad and actual word. Look, I'm making up spelling mistakes to be saying is to be probably a bit of hypocritical, but in case of spell check this. What's a spell check? True. It's not what you get when you type in on your phone, anyway. No, not no, really. No, the password is a Mary. That would have been too easy. <laughs> yes. What's the passcode? One, two, three, four. Fish key? Uh, da, da. Oh no, it's the piano from Mario 64! Oh, it's a mimic! Did I scare you? Oh, yeah, God, it's worse. You did. <laughs> You're here to find Mary, aren't you, James? Well, have you? No. Is that why you're here, too? She's here, isn't she? If you Maybe. know where she is, tell me. I'm tired of walking. I wish I knew. But she said it in her letter. What letter? I'm gonna read it. But don't tell Rachel, okay? Who's Rachel? She was our nurse. I took it from her locker. My dearest Laura, I'm leaving this letter with Rachel to give you to give to you after I'm gone. I'm far away now, in a quiet, beautiful place. Please forgive me for not saying goodbye before I left. Be well, Laura. Don't be too hard on the sisters. And Laura, about James. 
I know you hate him because you think he isn't nice to me, but please give him a chance. It's true, he may be a little surly sometimes, and he doesn't laugh much. Not to mention he has this weird obsession with jumping down holes and sticking his hands in toilets. Oh, but, yeah. But underneath, he's really a sweet person. Laura, I love you like my very own daughter. If things had worked out differently, I was hoping to adopt you. Happy 8th birthday, Laura. Your friend forever, Mary. I had guessed she was eight. <laughs> Laura, how old are you? Um, I turned eight last week. You had to think about when so your eight birthday was? Mary couldn't have died <laughs> three years ago. Could, could she really be here? Is this the quiet, beautiful place she was talking about? Me and Mary talked a lot about Silent Hill. She even showed me all her pictures. She really wanted to come back. That's why I'm here. Maybe you'll get it if you see the other letter. The one, Mary. Mm. Huh? I must have dropped it. Laura. I gotta find it. Laura! This kid loses a lot of things. Yeah. Also, she's pretty. Yeah. It's maybe just a PS2 Tyson, but it's got good graphics for PS2. Mm hmm. I don't know his face. Just then was. Uncanny Valley. Mmm. Could also be because she's a child. <laughs> children are scary. Black that children. Oh, hi! I am sorry you horrific and represent a horrible act and you must die. Ah! You bit me in the head, you bastard! How much did I take off of my health? Enough. <laughs> Oh, to make a horrible comment. <laughs> but it won't. <laughs> Look, it's got an ass. There's your horrible comment for the day. <laughs> so, you're just asking around now. <laughs> now, to find where this fish key goes to. Most of the locked doors seem to be upstairs. So the other rooms are blocked off. Oh sure, nothing in this room. Or this <laughs> hallway. Oh it are. Do we watch it? Bring me Bob. I'll try it on 202 and 204 first. If not, I'm going to try the other side. Oh, good. More of you. Hey, quit biting me in the head, you freak. Jerk. Probably should start pulling out the gun, <laughs> but I'm like, I want to save that for boss battles. Nope, okay. So let's try the other side. Unless the fish key goes to the music box area. If you want to try your biscuits, you have to join a club. Don't know why. That little advert jingle just came to mind.
All right, let's try you. Are you of importance? No. Okay. It's locked. It's jammed. It mocks our existence just by existing. How duh. Maybe the did the key go to the briefcase then? Oh no, that had a code. So the other thing I could think of is it went to the music box area. Key fish shape, it was on the top of the restaurant table. Nope, okay, not that. I also need more healing. <laughs> Don't think it was in the gift shop. I'm gonna save anyway. Yeah. <clears throat> well, why not, James? You'd be better off if you left. <laughs> but he won't get his answers. Who needs answers? We got a fish key. Who the hell's we got a fish key? Exactly. And the elevator don't work. I think you need to get in there at some point. You would assume, especially since we can't get up the stairs yet. Oh, wait, this is outside, isn't it? Yeah. Let me see. Was there anything outside that I need to worry about? Doesn't look it. Oh, my God. Cthulhu has just risen out, out, of the ocean, out of the lake and we're going back in to ignore that nonsense. Yeah, he's busy off saving the world. Hanging out with strange groupies. Yeah. Including, like, a wizard and an alien cat. <laughs> it all makes perfect sense. Exactly. I don't remember if we've been in here or not. Unless the key operates the main gate up on the third floor, which I doubt. <laughs> nope. Um, head back to receptions because there may be a note on the counter. Ah, uh, okay. Reception, where were you again? You were... I think you were back downstairs. Do 
there. Nope, no further. Candy Graham. And, uh, ooh. There we go. Mr. James Sunman, the videotape you forgot here is being kept in the office on the first floor. Office on the first floor, you say? Yep. Because this is where I got the key for the room. Uh, grab the key to room 3, B12. Which I believe you, you just said you can't. Yep. Exit reception. Go back to the main hallway and go down to B1F. Once down there, make your way past two mannequins and grab the thinner in the elevator. Then go back upstairs. I can't get into the elevator. Hmm. I might need to go down to the basement first. Maybe. There we go, we're making progress. I think you guys take more hits than the... What are those called? I want to say Leather Daddy, but I don't think that's right. The Dolmen? There you go. Hello, there's the item. Now I play with the, the elevator? No, of course not. The abstract daddy. Okay. Either way is disturbing. Yeah. Well, we got the thinner at the very least. Woo! And you're you don't exist. You don't exist either. You're not even a door, apparently. <laughs> now the question is, what to do with this thinner? <laughs> 